Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will show you how to oh, embed a uh, virtual computers. There's in Hyperbeam virtual computers inside your website, or more like a running Chrome in the Chrome or or in the web browser is that is installed on your PC or laptop. So before we will continue. So to register into the Hyperbeam website, you can just use Hyperbeam and wait for a moment. Alright, so there is uh, two options. Uh, I we will we will choose this one. Alright, so there is uh, two free login options. You can use a uh, GitHub. You can use uh, Google or type your email address here. It will automatically register. Later, if you don't yet have a credit account with that email, so we will continue with GitHub and then choose this one again. And here it is, we go. There's a two keys, two API keys right here. Uh, there is a test secret key and production secret key, which is have a different use case. So, the test secret key, the first API key that you can use for uh, testing for example you want want to test the back end so uh, the back end will really creating the hyper beam web browser virtual web browser se session without uh, errors so there is uh, also a production secret key you can only can fill the production secret key on so you need to copy the, the key immediately and save in in and paste the production key in, in a safe place. There is a, a free time year limit. Uh, the testing one only have a uh, two two simultaneous co active computers and also, but there is unlimited minutes, so you don't need to worry if you want to uh, test the. The virtual web browser, but in the production, we we got a uh, ten multiple active computers and also a uh, ten thousand mm, three minutes per month. And there is a uh, usage history. You can export it to CSV if you want. And of course, here is a documentation of the Hyperbeam API, which I told now. So uh, yeah, there is a basic one function to start a, a chromium web browser i have a, a my discord bot right here uh, it will um, right, it will will start the chromium session on hyperbeam with uh, star url google.com so there is a con kiosk mode so if you want to um, get someone else website without uh, this navigation bar I guess uh, you can use the kiosk mode but then set it to true and control disable default so if you don't want to and you want to control the web browser you can set it to fall true and region is I set is Asia and new block is set to true webgl is also enabled hold with uh, 720 pixel resolution and 60 fps search in default search engine is uh, google but you also can use DuckDuckGo if you want dark mode is enabled and and head cursor is true so we don't see uh, two cursors or it's moving around when we use a, a virtual web browser 